y'all i hope you are having a fantastic day i know i'm a little late i have a phone call i had to take care of so i'm here now today we will be making french onion beef stroganoff and usually when i make beef stroganoff i use ground beef but for this recipe i asked the lady to get me beef stew meat she got me beef kebabs this will work. That did not. Oh no. That's Hungarian. Honey. French onion. My book closed on me. Um. That did not touch the meat, so. Alright. And Grandma just had the freezer last night. Uh, no, the little black plastic thing is still in there. Let me. Alright. And usually I would prep this ahead, but I we didn't have time i was in too much pain so we are going to do it now so next and of course i forget a spoon hold on i got a spoon now all right So, add some garlic. Alright. Some basil. Parsley. Oregano. Rosemary. Nope, that's not one of, one of the ones I need. <laughs> There's a spice over here I thought I needed, but it's not on my list. All right, onion powder. Perfect, all right. And then we're gonna add both packets of the onion soup mix. I get either the beef or the onion and mushroom, which Grandma was so nice and opened these for me. Thank you, Grandma. All right, perfect. And then we're gonna add one cup of beef broth, which we're gonna just guesstimate. Cause, um, Cause I don't have a measuring spoon on me and I'm in pain. So you'll have to work with me a little bit today. All right, so. Make sure I added everything, stew meat, garlic, spices, beef broth. All right, perfect. You're supposed to add mushrooms, but we do not have mushrooms on hand. You're gonna cook this on low for eight hours. Half an hour before serving, you're gonna add four ounces of cream cheese and one cup of sour cream. You're gonna mix it in with the pasta and serve. I hope you all have a great rest of your day, continue to be amazing, and I will be live tomorrow. See you soon. Bye, y'all.